Yo, what up, what up, what up, man? We in another episode of Uncomfortable Conversations with Lloyd C. Christian Jr., man. Let's talk about it. Today's episode, we're going to talk a little bit about why the rich keep getting richer and what is it that we are doing so that we can get to the playing field that they own. Um, the first thing is this. The rich keep getting richer because... They learn how to invest in assets and not spending money on liabilities, man. Some of you guys love to spend money on liabilities. You love to do things that don't make sense. To me, if it ain't making dollars, it ain't making sense, man. And I'm going to tell you guys this, that every single day you focus on not investing in your future, you're wasting time because money can be compound interest if you if you do it the right way. So I want you guys to be so locked into your vision, so locked into your goals that you look up and say, man, you know what? I'm going to position myself so that I can get rich and I can stay rich. All right. The next thing is this. The rich keep getting richer because they learn how to leverage. They learn how to leverage debt. All right. Some of you guys are in debt, but you're not leveraging your debt. So basically, like, for instance, say you had a $100,000 credit card or a $10,000 credit card. How can you take that $10,000 and turn that $10,000 $10, to some kind of investment that you can flip? I think people, men, mental capacity, they don't, even, they don't even understand exactly how that works, man. So you got you to gotta personally ask yourself, like, how can you leverage debt? What is that thing that's helping you leverage debt when it comes to you getting rich and when it comes to you staying rich and why the rich keep getting richer? The next thing is this. The rich learn and they adapt to situations, to the economy, to what's going on. Why is it that you're not adapting, man? You know them eggs in them stores, it's $10. I, I, I don't never remember. I don't never remember spending more than five dollars for some eggs. These eggs are ten dollars. So think inflation going up, but your bank account staying the same. So it's something ain't right with what you're doing, man. Why is your bank account staying the same, but investments going up? Like everything else going up. You got to ask yourself, like, how are you gonna? position yourself so that you can get the results that you're looking for so that the rich is getting richer because they learn and they adapt to the economy so they learn like what's the what's the hottest thing going they learn how they can leverage their income they learn how they can leverage everything and they sit back and they maximize every moment why haven't you maximized your moments these are questions you got to ask yourself why haven't you maximized your moments and why haven't you leveraged the things that you are leveraging, all right? Another another reason why the rich keep getting rich and the rich stay rich is because they have a financial plan, man. You know, we have a thing we call fight for zeros. What we do is every single day we fight for zeros. That means you can't swipe our cards Monday through Friday, all right? We take the cash out on Sunday. That's called fight for zero. Well, we have a financial plan, a financial goal that's helping us get to the next level. And you guys got to position yourself, your life, your brand, and your legacy so that you can have a financial goal, okay? Once that happens, is, then you can see exactly what it is that you need to do. And this is how the rich keep getting richer because they understand a couple of principles and they stick to them and they grind, they grind, they grind. And then everything they look up, everything is maximizing for that moment, okay? The next thing is this, all right? They check on their financials daily. Some of you guys don't even want to look at your bank account because you feel like, man, I ain't got no money in there. I don't know what I got to do. Listen, man, when you look at your bank account, you know what's money coming in. You know what money coming out. You know exactly what you got to do. Then that helps you be able to financially calculate everything so you can get to the place where you deserve to be. And so that this is why the rich keep getting richer, man. They got financial goals. They got financial plans. They maximizing, they leveraging their income. They investing in things. They going to new levels and new heights. And you still in that same mind frame. You still in that same, you know, mindset. And you haven't realized the exact thing that you need to do so that you can get to where you need to go, man. I'm telling you guys right now, man, you have 
to leverage leverage everything is about leverage man and the last thing is this i tell people if you got one source of income you're too close to zero the rich keep getting richer because they have multiple streams of income all right you have to figure out how to diversify your income you got to understand the difference between earned income residual income once you understand the difference then you can you can ask yourself am i earning the money am i getting the residual you know what is if i have that money coming in every day then i have money i'm not working for you know what i'm saying that's the thing i call you can have a face business where people can see your face or you can have a faceless business where they don't have to even see your face but you'll be making money because you started different businesses so I need you guys to understand the reason why the rich keep getting richer because they understand about debt. They understand about financial income. They understand about how to fight for zeros and they are maximizing every single piece of income that they are getting. They are maximizing it and they creating the things they need to create, man. Listen, man, this is an uncomfortable conversation that we having about entrepreneurship with Lloyd C. Christian Jr., man. Remember, go out to design the life you want, create the brand you deserve, but most importantly, leave your legacy, man, because legacy is greater than currency. Other than that, man, listen, I'm glad you guys are here. Hope you took some notes. Hopefully you got your mind on the right level and hopefully we gave you the right mindset at the right time to give you the results you're looking for. I see you guys in the next video. Uncomfortable conversations with Lloyd, man. Don't forget to like and comment below. We got more videos coming. This is episode number four, season number one.